Over the last 105 years, YMCA has been committed to serving the community. We conduct numerous programs and enrichment activities which are tailored to suit the different needs of society. YMCA organizes a host of programs to improve the lives of the less fortunate. Programs like the YCAM Challenge, Care to Dance, and Why Nature Walk expose the intellectually and mentally challenged to activities which they would not normally participate in. In reaching out to the less fortunate beyond the Y, the Citibank YMCA Youth for Causes program promotes social entrepreneurship among youth, which goes to benefit other charitable organizations. YMCA serves the younger generation through various fitness and dance activities, outdoor and adventure programs, as well as our YMCA school and child development and student care centers. The YMCA Plain English Speaking Award competition and Mandarin Speaking Award help raise the standards of spoken language and provide avenues for the young to develop their talents in public speaking. YMCA also reaches out to youth at risk and out of school youth to help them discover their purposes in life through YMCA Project Bridge. YMCA reaches out to the elderly through various visits and activities. We seek to warm the hearts of the elderly and bring cheer to those in old folks' homes or those who live alone. YMCA extends its outreach overseas to the less fortunate through the international service programs to Cambodia and China. The programs which benefit the village community involve teaching of English, arts and music lessons, conducting road repairs and refurbishing of local school classrooms. We also conduct language enrichment programs and exchange programs with our overseas YMCA counterparts to foster better understanding across cultures. YMCA seeks to serve and enrich all members of the community, regardless of race, language or religion, through wholesome programs to develop body, mind and spirit, which are based on Christian principles. When the night has come, and I have to discipline myself by at least doing exercise three times a week. We enjoy the music, we love uh, the steps that this teacher teaches us and it's generally fun as well as a good way to keep fit. It's really nice coming here three times a week because uh, working at home and with the children having a very busy schedule, you don't get time to tone your body and this exercise is really helping me to tone up my body and to stay physically fit. Oh, stand by me. Oh, stand. There's no more stuff about scuttling, yeah, how and how it can help to beautify the place and help with the people. Um, in this home, I learned many new terms that I never knew before, like destitute, dementia, and uh, illness like OCD. Like, when I learned them, I learned how to take care of the old people. I won't cry. I won't cry. It gives the volunteers, uh, the students and people like you all an opportunity to come in to do something to benefit our residents, the elderly destitute. I think you know, without activities, uh, to them, they will sit down there and look at the sky and they think that the end of the world is coming. But I think with all these type of activities, it gives them some meaning. This volunteering experience has allowed me to come into contact with the different people. So it has made me more compassionate, more patient and definitely more accommodating to different people with different backgrounds. Together with our dedicated members and volunteers, YMCA has grown from strength to strength, fulfilling our mission of touching lives and lifting spirits. <laughs>